Hi, I'm Jared Gensel, Director of the Humanitarian Supply Chain Lab at MIT, and I'm the instructor for the course. So, uh, where are we? We are in the middle of the MIT campus, so we're going to be featuring with each section of the course a different location on the MIT campus to give you a little bit of a tour. And we're starting in the center. So around me is the uh, Student Center here, the Kresge Auditorium, the Interfaith Chapel, and across Massachusetts Avenue is the MIT Dome. So we are really at the, at the heart of campus, but we're specifically here to feature this statue called the Alchemist. I, I like this statue a lot because it's, you know, a bunch of symbols and letters that come together to form a structure, and the structure is actually a human being. And you're going to get a lot of terminology this week and new language uh, understanding humanitarian systems and logistics systems, and it may seem like a garbled mess like this and at first, but hopefully this will start coming together as you see the structure of the systems that are going to be essential for us to meet people's needs in crisis. I, I also love that this statue does form the shape of a human being, because even I as an engineer sometimes get too caught up into the system and tend to forget the humans we're actually intending to serve, so it's a good grounding for me to think of this statue. You can also come inside. So this section one is kind of your invitation to step inside the humanitarian systems and logistic systems that need to come together to serve people in a crisis. And uh, let's start beginning a language. I know this, this terms might be new, but start practicing the language that we're gonna need and understanding the structure that's gonna be the foundation for the plans that we're gonna be making going forward. So let's begin that conversation in section one.